slaughter, pure and simple. We're under attack! Sergeant Stagine led us from Wayrest when he heard about a drag invasion. It was chaos. Folk were fighting drag in the street. The sergeant sent me for reinforcements. Can you help? Damn Dreg are everywhere, and these citizens have lost their minds. They're attacking Dreg barehanded. I've saved as many as I can, but that last Dreg wounded me. Help! Check on Adil Sharness. Her house is just north of here. She told me Dreg took her husband. I need to stay here to keep an eye on the defense, but I'd appreciate it if you could help her out. Damn Dregor, you're telling me. It was a slaughter on both sides. The sergeant said there were Dreg eggs among the houses. And the Dreg must have come after them. I don't know. The slums are on Lord Sorik's land, but he refuses to send more soldiers. He acts like he's enjoying the slaughter. We must stop this before all the peasants get themselves killed. You can help by taking eggs from the slums back to the pools. Mara, bless you for helping these people. They don't have anyone else to turn to. Just don't get yourself killed, all right?
drag her thinning out, retreating. Did you succeed? Mara willing. That will calm the blasted things down. Of course, there's still the matter of who brought the dreg eggs here in the first place. Dreg side's returning to normal. We'll cordon off the dreg and let the guards sort things out. Guess your work here's done. Check on Adil Sharness. Her house is just north of here. She told me dreg took her husband. I need to stay here to keep an eye on the defense, but I'd appreciate it if you could help her out. They took him. They took... They took my husband. He was only trying to defend our homes, but the dreg took him. Please, stranger, can you help? The dreg. They attacked us out of nowhere. My husband tried to fight back. Those things wounded him and dragged him off. To their spawning pools. Arcady might still be alive. May the ape bless you for helping us. Please, find my Arcady. Their hatching pools are nearby, but they've never bothered us before. For some reason, the dreg came into town looking for trouble, and the people fought back. Some were killed, but others were dragged away. It's awful. The dreg came clattering into Dregside, attacking people. It was terrifying. My husband, Arcady, tried to rally folks to fight back. Sergeant Stegin brought a few guards. He's a good man, but it was four of them against all those dreg. Baron Sorik owns this land. We begged for more guards, but he says the dreg will leave on their own. Doesn't he care? Thanks. I'm getting out of here. Okay, bless you. Okay, bless you. Thanks. I'm getting out of here. I saw Dreg dragging Arcady toward the statue of King Jolie. That way.
I can breathe again. Thank the Eight, I can breathe. I'm not hurt, but I'd be dead without you. The Dreg were keeping us for food and feeding us to their young. The little ones would gnaw through the mud and... It doesn't matter now. I'm going to find whoever's responsible for this. When I find out who did this to me, to us, I'll kill him. I'm not sure, but that dead man at arms there was one of them. I saw them bringing drag eggs into town from the pools. But they saw me too. That's how I ended up here. He tagged along behind the dreg to make sure they disposed of me. I guess he just got too close. Serves him right, the rat. Can't you see I'm busy? Just in time. My glass is empty. What? What's this? Another gutter snipe here to whine about the dreg? <laughs> I'll just say you wrote it yourself. It's my word against yours, and I'm a Breton nobleman. Don't waste my time. I admit, that might be enough to be inconvenient. Both dreg's side and the hatching pools are in my fief. Both are infested with pests. I just came up with a brilliant way to have them exterminate each other. What of it, Lowborn? You'll never catch me, fool! My leg! One of these ruffians broke my leg! Please, don't leave me here! Have mercy! What's all this, then? You better. I see a noble here surrounded by an angry mob of commoners. Now, just between you and me, I think I know what this is about. So what can you tell me that'll clear this up? I suspected Baron Sorek from the start. Don't worry, he'll pay for his crimes. I'll take it from here. <laughs> 